Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to Zenith. I uh, have played this on the channel before, but when I played it before it was on the uh, it was on the PlayStation VR 1, which obviously I've got the PlayStation VR 2 now, so let's go ahead and do this. Uh, this will probably just kind of be like a little look at thing. I don't know if I want to continue with this series. I've got a bunch of characters. I think I've got like six or seven characters right now already. Uh, that's the one I started with, John Dolier. Uh, and, uh, this is the one I just made, Luke Kaiser. So, we're gonna be going to be go ahead and play that. So, man, it's gonna be DPS, uh, we're gonna go smooth, or locomotion. We're gonna be going through the tutorial, and, uh, yeah, basic controls and whatnot. I'm gonna be changing the volume around, maybe reduce the sound of the, uh, the music and whatnot. So, yeah. But anyway, uh, I like this one. I think it's, uh, I think it's I pretty neat. the corruption. The darkness that enveloped the land and created the fracture. We believed that our world had fallen, but we rose above it. Our heroes fought valiantly, but one by one they fell, and now Zenith is all that remains. The last vestiges of our society. The last bastion of hope. The last city. If we are to survive, we'll need a new generation of heroes. Here, at the Academy, you'll learn to control and focus your essence. Wield it as both a weapon and a shield. And become the hero you were meant to be. Oh, this is... this is all new! Okay. They completely redid the opening to this game. So before, you used to just start in, like, the... like, the sewers in the city and stuff like that. So, it's kinda... kinda cool that they, uh, they did that. Looks like our weapons, Reese. Where's the sound? No sounds for our weapons? <laughs> Hang on a second. Okay, let's see here. What do we got for menus? Menu looks a little bit closer, too. Okay, so, what do we got here? Bloom, fine, press, press, adjust, tone mapping, quality levels. Let's go ahead and put it at medium. I'm fine with that. Um, just to make sure everything runs pretty well. Audio, uh, music. Ah, I don't know why all these are turned down so low. Let's go ahead and turn these up and we'll turn the music down to like half. And ambience, let's put that there. Dialogue, let's... Uh, that up there you go yeah I don't know why I don't know why it was so like you know set off the wrong way but okay let me look at now I oh, can't do it here Hang on. let's see okay that sounds good okay let's see what else do we have here for options we've got uh, settings and logout what, uh, what do we have here settings you know, logout experience stats and stuff uh, comfort settings. What do we have? Locomotion, climbing, gliding. Good, smooth, smooth, smooth. Uh, da, da, da. Turning. We're at 45 degrees. That's okay. Uh, what's this? Oh, smooth turn. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's keep that at 45 for now. Uh, that'll be fine. Yeah. So that's a that's a 45. Uh, smooth turning is like this. I'm not really a big fan of smooth turning. I mean, I could I could get used to it, obviously, but I don't know. I've been using snap turning so long that that's just kind of what I'm used to. Uh, what do we got here? Basic strafe. Gliding is set for sensitive. I can't remember what I had that at before. It might have been strafe, but whatever. doesn't matter. Uh, okay, comfort settings fine. Agent rank. Dungeons roulettes. Quest journal. World map. Friends and party. I can't remember. Uh, there were a couple people that were in my friends list. Life skills. We've got nothing for that right now. That's okay. Uh, the station. Is the station still... Oh, I can't do that right now. That's fine. Uh, various gestures and whatnot. Don't have to worry about that just yet. We've got some random things here. Okay. Not too bad. Board games. What? What is this? Spare into board game section. Interesting. Uh, that's new. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, it's been a little while since, uh, since I've played, but, uh, Anyway, uh, I'm playing as a DPS mage, I think they're called. Can't remember exactly what they called them. But 
Anyway. Let's do this. Okay. Yeah, X is to jump, obviously, and that also comes with the uh, gliding feature. You just put your hands to the side and you can glide. Pretty cool. Um, Alright, let's do this. Uh, I think there's also a teleport, right? And it's sprinting. Is the is there a teleport? Where is it? Where is it? Hang on. Hang on. Bang, bang! Finger guns! Okay, no, I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna worry about that. Uh, right now, the movement is set to your, uh, like, where you're actually looking. So I'm pressing forward on the analog stick, keeping my hand in one spot. So it is based upon your heading, I suppose. Uh, yes. Twice. Jump twice. Okay, got it. Okay, where's this? Ah. Oh, Definitely. There you are. I thought we'd lost you. Hey, uh, Ellie was looking for you. You better go find her. Hey, kid. Good to see you. Better get a move on. Okay. It's all new. Okay. Cool. Let's, uh, go do that, I guess. It's nice that they put, like, an actual tutorial kind of a place in here. That's nice. Oh, yeah. You can wave to quest givers, and the little thing is going to fill up. Once that's full, it'll activate, which is pretty good. Okay. Do, do, do. Basic training. All right. Oh, they still want me to wave? Is that the thing you want me to do? Yes, yes. Make your way over to the hmm. training circle. Let's get started. Okay. I'll be with you every step of the way. Hey, Ellie here. Can you hear me? All right. First order of business today is basic combat training. Grab yourself a weapon and let's get started. Well, I got to say the uh <laughs> <laughs> the the voice acting is definitely uh, interesting, I'll say that. Okay, so, got my weapons. Finger guns. Pew, 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 pew. So you can see them charge with that little number that's next to it. hand empty, hold the highlighted button, and perform a gesture downwards. Keep your hand held, or button held, release to perform the ability. Abilities have a mana cooldown cost. Check your HUD for their status. Uh, uh, I think it was, yeah, this one. There you go. Pretty good. You can uh, do it with both hands, I think. Um, I don't have enough to do it with both hands right now, ladies, but... Uh, it's fairly intuitive. All right, you see those targets? Knock them out. There you go. Okay, that was great. Take that little back. bit of money. That'll be it for life today. Okay. Uh huh. Complete. Yes. Hey kid, you got I mean, me. Yes. <laughs> Okay. Easy peasy. I like the gliding. The gliding's fun. Okay. Please. Ta da! We did it. Level up too. I wonder if they're gonna still make us go down to like the sewer and visit all that trust me Ellie it's better this way I'll be perfectly content if you never have to take up arms against another living soul well there you are another big day ahead of you today 
Why don't you meet up with Marcus at the training sim plaza when you're ready? Oh, training seems boring. Right. I can't remember how the voice acting was done before. Might have, uh... I don't know. Reset all that. Your menu should close automatically as well. Not too bad. So I was also playing that, uh, one of those new games that came out, or well, a demo for one of those new games called, uh, Drums Rock. It's pretty good. I liked it. Might actually buy it. It's only 20 bucks, so it's not even asking that much. All right, let's do this. All right, let's get started. I figured out the first wave of Sims now. Look alive. Good staggered nerd. So yeah, glowing red spots means uh, you deal extra damage and stuff like that. It's pretty, pretty self-explanatory. So you can see it did like double damage there. So not too bad. Uh, done. He's got something else for us, too. Okay. Quest 2. Go to the second training plaza. There we go. Do, 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 do. Carefully, okay? Sometimes you need to put a little distance between you and your opponent. Let's see how you do with ranged adversaries. Go on. Give it a try. Throwing spells. Under two projectiles. Okay. There you go. Now I have a fireball. Come on. Conjure, dang it. Yeah, I have to do it with the right hand, not the left hand. Oops. <laughs> I'll obviously get better at that as we continue. Oh yeah, you have to wait a number of seconds. Okay, destroy the floating targets. Okay. I don't know if they specifically want me to use that, but... Two of them destroyed. There we go. You're making the rest of us look bad. That was some fantastic work. I don't know where the last thing was. Was that a Naga? So listen, this is gonna be your third and final lesson for today. You've learned a lot. Now I want to see you put it all together and take on something tougher. Marcus, give him the snake. The snake what? Yep, that's a Naga. I mean, it's a snake humanoid, but whatever. Don't mind me, I'll just uh, be over here charging. <laughs> How about fireball? 
Okay. I mean, the tutorial's definitely a, I don't know, a bit better, I would suppose to, I would suppose it is. Did you enjoy our state-of-the-art hologram technology? So the fireball can only be done with the Did right hand. Call it a day? By the way. What? Lyra? She spoke with you. Well, you must have done something right to her. And for what it's worth, I'm inclined to agree. Yay! Level five. Let's go. I'm gonna probably keep this episode at around an hour or so, just so you guys can get a good idea of the beginning of the game, what new players can expect, stuff like that. Ah, got my upward spell now. That probably won't hit somebody. Man, why do I need to get your oranges? Why don't you get your own stupid oranges? Alright. I like the little fireball, though. It doesn't take mana to use, it's just a cooldown ability. So, it's not too bad. Oh yeah, the climbing. The climbing's kind of fun. Uh, tap L2 and R2 to continue and all that stuff, yeah. Let's do some climbing. It's uh, good. I believe you do have a stamina system as well to deal with. Okay. Yeah. You got a you got a T pose to glide. It's kind of funny. Wee. Yeah, I think the uh, the way that I did it before with the gliding and all that is if you like turned your body, you would actually uh, do this the thing where you do all that stuff. They want us to get these oranges. Yes, get out of here. I'm trying to get oranges here. Let's see. There we go. Let's uh, get that. And another one up there. There we go. Lyra, she she probably talked to you about the corruption, didn't she? Mm-hmm. You must have a lot of questions. Listen, kid, I'm not, uh, I can't presume to understand how you feel, being cursed and all. Now, Marcus and Ellie, they're good kids, but I bet the others used to give you grief about it. Tried to make you feel small, make you feel insignificant. I don't know what it's like to be silent and be unkind like that. But what I do know is that, well, you're among family here. And yes, we do expect great things from you. From all of you. But just remember that you can also talk to me. Okay? And, well, yeah. I guess, I guess that's it, kid. Now, where the hell are those oranges? <laughs> okay! This guy. Sitting here. Now, where the hell are those oranges? Come on, man. You're the one that's distracting me. You know somebody's sitting here farming money off this thing. Da, da, da. I might have to change the uh, movement controls to be for the. Uh, what's this? Hit your rank. Yeah. 
Okay. I guess. Uh, let's go ahead and change... Uh, where are the settings and lockout? Uh, no, not that. It's probably going to be comfort settings. Turning. Uh, left hand swap input. Toggle hold for grip. Grip sensitivity, release sensitivity. Interesting. Uh, no, I don't want to do that. I want to... Let's mute our mic, by the way. Uh... Now, what I want to change is heading, like where you're moving. Graphics. Hmm. Did I just miss the setting, or? Jumping. Focus UI camera shake. Movement? What's this? Yeah, okay. Uh, I don't know. Whatever. We'll, uh, we'll just deal with it. You gonna make me an orange smoothie now? Or are you gonna make me do it? Oh. I don't have much time. Listen carefully, kid. We are under attack from an exiled army. I can guide you out of there. All right. This is a hologram training. This is life and death. Just follow my lead and do exactly as I say. Got it? I got to say it, man. The the voice acting's bad. <laughs> like I got a lot of respect for voice actors. I do. It's it's not an easy job. Um ooh. But yeah. There's like no emotion behind these lines. He doesn't care. <laughs> Simpsons reference. He's invincible. Damn it, kid. I told you to keep moving. I'm going. Calm down. Guess we're doing some gliding. Oh, Consider me smashed through. Don't take that out of context. <laughs> okay, so I remember this. Uh, before we used to uh, start on that side of the city, and we'd cross this whole big bridge to get over to this area where you do your first fighting. So, not too bad. Oh, hey. Entered the fractured planes. You're back. Before the fracture, they were just plain, which sounds a bit insulting, no? I just. <laughs> this was once a bustling crossroad and marketplace for Zenithian travelers. And with yours and Zenith's help, it will be again one day. Okay, bye. This is, uh, this is something. Okay, we should get some enemies over here that we'll have to deal with. Yeah, there we go. Take that. Pretty sure we can uh, get some equipment and stuff like that from these guys. I remember their attacks also being a lot harder to dodge. I think we can, yeah, we can grab from a distance with those things. Not too bad. 
I know there's not too, too many people playing right now. Um, so, yeah. Not too bad. Grab the thing. Okay. Now we got some stuff to do. Actual, like, tutorial and crap like that. So, let's, uh, get on with it. Interesting. Didn't actually, uh, hit you with that lightning bolt. Maybe it's... Maybe the AoE for the damage is strictly where the, uh, the actual the thing is. Like the ground. I know that there's a number of those little tier things that we can get. Let's go talk to this person. What up? Up for the challenge, of course. Okay. Come back. Job is done. Ranged sylphids. So the ranged ones are the uh, the ones that use the magic and stuff like that, if that wasn't entirely obvious. So, that guy right there. Whoa. A little high. bad. Give me the thing. Oh, nice. We got ourselves some new, uh, new gloves. Uh, let's see. Level three. Nice. What's the difference? Primary stat three, armor 70. I think primary stat is related to your, uh, like your damage and stuff like that. I can't remember exactly. But not too bad. I guess we can kind of run around this whole area and get in trouble. Oh, nice. We got a new weapon. Love to see it. Okay, so that's in our left hand now. 26 damage instead of 25. Not great, but whatever. It does change the look of it, too, slightly. So that's pretty cool. you up. Uh, let's see. Where was another... There's a thing. can't remember if that's like a quest or not, though. It might be. Ah, skirmish. Okay. Yeah. I don't think I need to worry about a skirmish right now. Eh, I don't know. We'll just keep walking around. Yeah. I like how it's still giving us a notification for break through the gate. Like, hey, hey, hey. Stop shooting at me. Cookie! No. Get out of here. Okay. These guys are a little bit high level. Run! That is a very high-level skirmish for, like, the very beginning of the game. Interesting. Okay, so it's still telling us to break through the gate. Where's the gate? I don't know. Guess we should probably talk to this person that's right next to the beginning area, right? Bug enthusiast. Final two creatures need to ensure... Well, what are you talking about? Okay, toss the orb, but the creature de depleted stamina. Okay. I guess. Creature catching. Uh, equip creature orbs to your quick slots, grab and throw them at creatures to trap them inside. Pokemon, basically. <laughs> okay. Cool, I guess. 
Uh, advanced. Reduce your creature's stamina more by being accurate with your throws and standing further away. Press the trigger to detonate the orb before it lands. Hmm. Hunting is it's basically Pokemon, but with grenades. Got it. Okay, so. Uh, where the heck's our... Here's our quick slot. Where's our uh, little capture things? Hey, did you have some of those for me? Guess not. Yeah. Okay. Uh, where's my orbs, my man? <laughs> Can't remember how this little thing works. Let's see here. What do we got? Uh, circle button. Teleport arc instantly teleport. Enemies will you teleport away from you. Oh, you teleport away from take damage. The movement speed is slowed. Okay. So that would be uh, this button. Yeah, not too bad, right? Bah! differently. Yeah. I think we're going to do that. Event start. No, I don't want to start events. Stop it. <laughs> okay. Let's see here real quick. Sorry I keep going through all the settings and everything. Kind of. Uh, toggle grip. Okay, that's fine. There we go. Let's try that now. There we go. So now I can have a little bit more control over it. Oh, he says, because he messes up. The sword play in this is also pretty cool as well. Um, I, I, I had a, a pretty decent time playing with the... Uh, oh, I got something from that event ending. Yeah, I had a pretty good time with it, though. Yeah, there's a lot that you can do in this. It's pretty decent so far. Alright, so we still have to kill more of those things, but... Uh, players... That's something over there. I don't know. Let's go check it out. Why not? Oh, look. Another one of these guys. Nyo, nyo, nyo. Yeah, give me those noodles. Heck yeah. No. Oh. So I don't have enough for that. Uh, this is an event. I remember this event, actually. This one's just fighting a bunch of these kinds of enemies. Which. Not too bad, I guess. Oops. Get used to it. I know you can grab stuff from, like, further away. <laughs> Oops. Chucked a fireball on the ground. Searing shot level two. Okay, I think those were just the uh, regular ones I was using. No, that's magma orb. There's, uh... There it is. Uh, projectile launcher to do damage. Gain 5% crit on hits. Okay, so they just trigger when I'm using my abilities. Is that just, uh... No? Can't remember. I think it just... I think it just does it when I... When I shoot, it acts like it... I think. Yeah, is what it is. Okay. I remember there used to be, like, plants and stuff you could gather here and get experience and stuff for that. Uh, it doesn't look like that's the case anymore. That's okay. Right now we're just gonna kind of walk around and see what's going on. Treasure chest underneath this bridge. Break 
through the gate. Let's see. Let's see if we can get some more information on what the heck we're supposed to be doing here, huh? Uh, quest journal. Uh, invasion. Okay. Escape. Yeah, it's just escape the invasion. Okay. Guess we've already kind of done that. But apparently not. I don't know. Yeah, they just want us to do all that. Yeah, okay. I guess we'll just continue on until something happens, I suppose. Not that big a deal. Nice. Give me this stuff. There we go. Yeah, apparently we can just breathe underwater. <laughs> about it. Just don't think too hard about it. Your life will be better if you don't think about things as hard. Oh. Okay, back off. Okay. I know that there's some higher level enemies over here. Where the heck are we going, game? Let's see. Where's the map? Okay, that's a shop. What we got here? Side quest available. See the world, creature collector, side quest, side quest, shop. Fast travel to the tavern. Zenith Academy. I mean, there's that. That's our mission, but is that where they want us to go? It's not, like, super clear. You know, this place doesn't, uh... I mean, there's the... the thing. <laughs> like, there's the little beacon. Maybe I skipped something on accident? I must have. Oof. Okay, stop exploding. Funny that you can't hear it, though. Uh, right, I don't think I can get through that. Okay. Oh, yeah, I must have uh, run through there too quick for the game <laughs> before. This will be fine. Don't worry. Just don't don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We're just gonna back over here and. Okay. <laughs> I made it. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Made it all the way over here without. Oh, jeez. Okay. So, uh, good, good. be careful, I guess, when you're in this beginning area. Otherwise, uh, <laughs> you might skip the necessary progression. Oof. Good, kid. I can see you up at the top. Look carefully. Do you see a small island up ahead? I need you to glide there and use the Waystone portal to get to safety. I'll activate it once you're there. The it was Waystone already activated, active. though. Use it to get to safety. Don't worry about the rest of us, kid. We'll, we'll catch up with you. Now go. Yeah, okay. Right. <laughs> so yeah, be careful, I guess, when you, uh, you know, get to, uh, that part. There, there we go. Okay. <laughs> All right. Glacial orb, nice. Okay. So now they want us to head into the plains and scout for intel. I was already out there. It's okay. It's Calling okay. all available agents and trainees. One of the outposts is currently under attack. Any oh, nearby nice. units should reroute there immediately and assist them. Let's take take it. Beans. Still there? I've marked some coordinates on your map. Make your way there now. Sure. Okay. Uh, I said I got a glacial orb. Yeah, okay. So this is damage. Slows the target. This is also damage. Also deals stagger damage. I guess let's uh, try that out. How long do I have to hold it for? Uh, whatever. Whoop. Missed. <laughs> Way too far. Okay. 
A little delayed, but that's okay. Head to the location. That way. Got it. So yeah, don't do what I did. And rush ahead too quickly. I know I, I was trying to escape from my life for crying out loud. Messed you up. Okay. Public events. Timed public events occur all over the world. Denoted by red spires. Red spire. I guess we're doing this. Participate in the event. Okay. Irking him. Okay, wave completed. Okay, stop. Public events. Meaning somebody can help. Oh, and there is a healer class of sorts. You're welcome. Hey kid, heard you handle yourself well out there. This is more than I thought. I've just marked some new coordinates on your map by the essence mines. Meet me there. Okay. Guess we'll continue. Snow, still nothing. Okay. I think there was stuff in these houses too. There was stuff in here. There's this thing, which can't really do anything with that, but yeah. There's a decent amount of little exploration in this game as well. Okay. Yeah, can't do anything with those. Okay. Do 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 do. Going that way. Oh, hey, I need to kill you. Cookie! No. So I believe when you pick those up, they're just like random things that you can use to like augment your your stuff. I believe could be incorrect, but uh, whatever, that's fine. Hi. Okay. That person's probably trying to talk to me, but I have everything muted. thing up there. yet. Oh, it can be on the seven. That's fine. Hmm. 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 The hell's that thing? Oh, that's one of those enemies. It's one of those little prism enemies or whatever. I don't know what they're called. Missed. Oh, we're not. Hey, hey, hey. Get over here. What are you doing? Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Look at this little guy. Cute. All right. I don't know why some of these enemies have their weak spots already vulnerable. I, 
Yeah, the combat in this is pretty, uh, pretty good, though. I enjoy it. Like, it's, it's obviously fairly simple, but what do you expect? You know, it's a, it's a VR MMO. You know, they can't get too crazy with the, uh, like, the buttons and presses and stuff like that, because you got to deal with latency issues, you got to deal with other players' abilities, and you got to deal with balancing, and, yeah, there's a lot of stuff to consider when it comes to MMOs. Like, not even getting into the whole VR aspect of it. Look at you! It's a freaking Weedle! <laughs> It's like a Caterpie Weedle. Oh, look, another one of those... those little guys. Oh, no. Oh. What? Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> right. <laughs> ah, damn it. <laughs> what is going on? Am I, like, too close to something, or is the server bugging? I think I was too close to... So let's... let's do this storyline thing first. Ah! Come on. Don't do this to me, game. Okay. That was weird. I think it had something to do with the where I was standing or something. I don't know. Okay. So, what do we get here? New armor. Good. It does change what you look like as well. Oh no, my arm. <laughs> okay. So what are we on right now? We're on, uh, head to Blossom Village. That way. Okie dokie. Can I grab this thing yet? Or are you gonna keep freaking out on me? Okay. <laughs> Normally you can kinda pull them towards you once you get close enough, but, uh, oh well. It is what it is. I wonder if this is like the same kind of a thing where the, the village gets all corrupted and taken over like it was before. Oh, spoiler warning, I guess. Anything over here? No? Okay. That's fine. Right now there's a pretty low population for the, uh, the PlayStation servers, because you can set up uh, which server you're in, obviously. It's never more. Mm-hmm. Maybe it also explains how they persuaded Sylphids and Nagas to fight alongside them. Try destroying some of the purple corrupt crystals and gather me some fragments. I think around five should do. Yeah. When I'm playing as this particular class, I kind of like to shoot with the left hand and use magic with the right. Oh, hey. Look at you. Okay, getting closer. like enhancement based things for upgrading your uh, gear and whatnot. Oh cool, these things still come back to you. That's kind of funny. Almost about to get level 7. Almost. Almost. I would like to level up before we're done with all this. Is this that person that was, like, super dead? Yeah, super dead. Okay. Maybe, like, one more kill? Alright. Let's grab the last crystal. What's up? Other than you, apparently. Alright, 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 alright. Not too bad. 
Oh, look, we got another ability. Uh, it looks like a flame ring. Nice. That's pretty cool. That's gonna be good for punishing things that get stuck into animations or something. I need to look into a new pad or something for the for the headset. It uh, it, it presses some some pressure points on the forehead. It starts to hurt after a little while. But uh, yeah, it's mostly a me problem, not a headset problem. Oh. Come on, let me turn this quest in. Good. Nice level three for searing shot. Good. Same with. Planar Traveler. I don't know exactly what that does, but it's good. Pillar of Earth. Okay. Use crystals to open the gate. Will do. Uh, but first, let's put on our new pants. Yeah. Look at that. Okay. Use crystals to open the gate. Where the heck are we going? In there, apparently? Ah, yeah. Okay. Grab items from here. Spark. Corrupted charge. There they are. Alright, so put those there. No, can't put those there. Weird. Grab items from here to use in the lock. Like here? Oh, hey, look at that. How about that? Ah, no, let's go. Okay, it's open. Okay, kid. Although, I guess after the way you perform, I can't really call you that anymore. That's right. Ah. The graduation ceremony you expected. Busy. Okay, you could stop doing this now, game. <laughs> Go get him. Come on! Okay. There's some weird interactions going on with uh, how this stuff is doing its thing. New gloves. How about that? Nice. Okay, go, go, get out of here. Get out of here, item prompt. I was kind of hoping that the, uh, like the little Pokeballs were going to be in here, but I guess not. Okay. We'll mess with all that at some other point, but anyway, let's continue. Fire! Oh. I guess we could just kind of wait to go in here and all that, but let's not worry about that for now. pretty nice. That's uh, this one here. You can equip the different ones that you get. Tier 1, quick wit, decrease cooldown. It's not bad. Don't have any upgrades to that, don't have any upgrades to that. I do have an upgrade to that, but this has got increased critical power of the ability. Okay, it's just Max XP on that, actually. You know, let's just keep that the way it is. Why not? Okay. Boss fight? Maybe. Oh, yeah. You're definitely a boss. Oh, jeez. This has got to be a server thing. The reason why it's having so much trouble. Do the thing. Oh. There you go. <laughs> I know, you can't believe it. Ridiculous. Okay, I beat him. Listen to the data stone recording. Looks like you found some more 
intel. Nice job. I think that's a ranged unit over there. For analysis. She should have an update for this. Like I said, ranged unit. Get those. Okay, let's get out of here. Probably have to fight some enemies that respawned. Yeah, I was gonna say. Oh. This has to be a server thing. It's gotta be, like, location-based or something. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> gonna have a bad time. Almost level eight. How about that? Get your finger guns. Da, 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 da. I almost never get tired of that. It's just kind of satisfying, you know. Do, 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 do. Congrats on your promotion, Agent. We've tracked the origin of that transmission you found to a location in Galia Village. Rendezvous with Field Officer Mika Yakini at the coordinates I just sent. Right. Anyway, that's going to do it as far as a uh, first look tutorial opening, you know, what you can kind of expect for the game. Uh, one thing I will say is that as far as the other classes are concerned, uh, they all play relatively differently. And I believe uh, at any point you can swap. So, like, I could go over here and go to support and all that, and it'll change all your gear and everything. Um, so you'll have to actually earn all your stuff back, but, uh, yeah, that, that is something you can do, um, and you can also change up your abilities and stuff like that, so, like, we've got Ether Spark here, uh, that's for the weapon stuff, you can get, uh, other things, like, they start out with the Glacial Orb, you can get Hydro Splat, but, uh, yeah, um, up until you actually get to the point where you can do that, you have to keep in mind that you are going to end up uh, using new equipment and stuff like that. So, like, these guys, I can't fight these guys. They will probably kill me. Uh, but if I go back to the beginning area, which I can just kind of do this. It's not where I want to fast travel. This is going to be way too far from where I want to go. But anyway, um, it is nice that you do have the, uh, the option to uh, swap out uh, for, you know, different roles and stuff like that. I think that's very cool. Um, but, uh, yeah, anyway, I think this is a pretty competent little MMO um, for what uh, what you can do in it and stuff like that. Um, but, yeah, anyway, uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, I might do more coverage of this, depending on... Okay, stop. <laughs> but, yeah, if you guys are interested in seeing more of, more of uh, you know, this game, let me know. Um, I, uh, I wouldn't be against playing it more, but, uh, yeah. All kind of depends on you guys. But anyway, I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Uh, Bye-bye.